but, but you can understand constituents are never going to campaign to close their hospital, even if the numbers are low, unless they are persuaded of a clinical argument that needs the backing of their local MP. And if they are told that actually distances to the nearest hospital may be a bit further, but you'll see a specialist and your, your rate of survival will increase as a result, that's the argument you need to make too. Well, if the argument is valid, I could see a case for someone doing it. But when you actually have eight years of consultations that are held behind closed doors in central London, and look at the, pre which are remote from the actual people in the constituency. Take a look at my example, the, the, the example I'm quoting in Chase Farm. If you say we're going to consult with the majority of people from Barnet, from Haringey and from Enfield, which is exactly the area we're talking about, is it any wonder that there is a majority which is based on Barnet and Haringey that says, you know what, we'd rather downgrade Chase Farm and give all the stuff to our neighbouring hospitals, which is now what is happening. So if you're going to have a transparent, open, honest consultation, I think the medical profession have a chance. But I'm not signing up to anything that's been going on in Chase Farm where it's not transparent, it hasn't been fair, and it, frankly it's wrong. Fine. Nick Dubois, Mike Brown, thank you very much.